Hey guys, so I have something I wanted to share with you. It's this right here. Um, this is BoxyCharm, so in case you don't know what this is, it is a monthly subscription box. I know I have had, I think, just about every subscription box on the planet. And um, as I get them, I kind of decide which ones I want to lose and which ones I want to keep. Um, so this year, I decided to kind of like narrow it down to a few that I really, really liked and ones that were very valuable. And this one was highly recommended. So I do Ipsy. I did the Sephora um, box. I've done Fit Fab Fun or Fab Fit Fun or whatever the heck it's called. Um, I've tried all different kinds and I just narrowed it down to a couple that I really like. So you guys know I like Deck of Scarlet. I get that every two months. It's a great product. I highly recommend it. And I'm about to get into this and show you um, kind of what's in there and why I like it. So without further ado, we're going to jump into this box, you guys. Seriously, I know you can't wait. Okay, so the box comes like this. You pop it open. It says, hello, Charmer. I am a Charmer. Not really, though. Um, so it comes with a little theme each month. So this month, the theme was Galaxy Glow. And on the back of it, it gives you kind of a description of all of the things that are in the box. So this was actually something I already, I knew what all was going to come in this box because I'm nosy and I got on YouTube the second that I knew the box was out. And so I'm not surprised by it, but I'm actually really excited by what all was included in this box. So I'll show you the items. Most of these items are either, they're either full size or a deluxe size sample, which is pretty much full size. Um, so the first thing that I noticed out of here are the, I'm going to save that for last actually, are the uh, Crown Pro uh, brushes. So Crown Brushes is a brand that I actually really like. I have lots of Crown Brushes and it came with a set of three. They were actually in boxes and individually wrapped and they look like this. I love this one. It's going to be great for contouring because of the way that it is at the end. You can intensify your contour in the middle and then press down more if you want a more chiseled cheek. Um, this one I think would be really great for a highlighter, um, you know, dusting it down the nose and then, I don't know, intensifying contour. And this is a great eyeshadow brush. I love this kind when I'm doing like my lid. So I'm really excited to try these out. I don't have any white ones with pink tips. These kind of remind me a little bit of the Wet n Wild ones that came out a while ago, which are actually really good. Um, but excited to try these. Um, these retail for $29.99. So yeah. Uh, I think I forgot to mention it before, but this box costs $21 a month, and you usually get over $100 in product, and I can attest to the fact that you do, because I'm going to keep showing you what we got. Okay, so next, we have the Cover FX Shimmer Veil, and Cover FX products are very expensive. If you don't know what they are, they are pretty much known for their highlighters and their liquid highlighters, um, but this, it has been touted as kind of like an eyeshadow, and I'll swatch it for you and show you what it looks like. It comes in a deluxe size sample. Actually, I think this one's full size. Is it full size? Yeah, this is a full size. This retails for $28. And <laughs> the, since the theme is Galaxy Glow, most everything looks holographic, but this stuff is gorgeous. I have a four-year-old just coming really close. So you can kind of see what that looks like. It's kind of like a pink metallic color. I think it's going to be really pretty on the eyes. But I'm excited about it. Also, it says you can use it all over your face. So if you wanted to use it as a highlighter, you certainly could. It does have little flecks of glitter in it. So I don't know if I would use it as a highlighter unless I was just trying to be a little extra. Stop. Okay, so that's that. Again, that was $28 on the website. So, so, so far, you've already got your money back. I mean, you've already got your money back with this for the $21. Okay, next item is the uh, Vintage Cosmetics uh, Smoky mm. Eye Pencil, and this is it right here. It is very dark, and it is just a pencil brush, but it's very dark. It looks nice. Um, this retails for $21, so you pay $21 for the box. This is $21, so that's three of the products that are in the box. Next, we have the Sugar and Lemon Seraphine Botanicals Lip Buffer. So, essentially what this is going to do... I love do, you, Mama. I love you, too. Go play. He's probably got pizza all over me because that's what he does. He rubs his face on me when he gets stuff on his face. Anyway, Seraphine Botanicals. It comes in this cute little container, and it has this... This is a full-size product, but it's basically a lip scrub. And I actually need a lip scrub because my lips get real dry, and I get some cracks right here. 
Um, so I'm actually looking forward to using this, and I'm going to smell it and tell you what it smells like. Ooh, it's sealed. Good. Yeah. We're being sanitary. Yeah, I go. Stop. Oh, yeah, I go. My kids are home. Yes, I'm opening it with my mouth. <laughs> when my kids are home, um, doing this is nearly impossible. But I had to wait until I was done with work today, so. All right. So I'm going to smell that and see. Ooh, it has, like, sugar in it. I don't know if you can see. It's got, like, little sugar particles in it. It smells delicious. Yeah, it smells like a lemon, so it smells amazing. Okay, I have it all over my hands now. Um, that has a retail price of $24. So, again, a $24 product in your $21 box. So all of this so far. And then finally, and I was actually really excited about this. Can you go get mommy a napkin, please? The last thing in here is a holographic um, highlighter kit by Naked Cosmetics. And you can see how pretty that is. Comes in a nice pretty packaging. And this refill, retails, refills. This retails for $39.99. And it's kind of following like the Aurora kit by Anastasia. It's like all of those little holographic crazy color highlighters. Now, I will say that I don't know <laughs> that I would wear these regularly. I'd probably pick up on some of the pinker colors and this yellow color here, but even when you swatch them, they are very, I don't know if you tell. Yeah, there thanks. You okay, to, to the rescue. Let me wipe my hand off so I can give you some better swatches, or maybe I'll do the swatches on my arm. That might be better. Yes, <laughs> that's what we're gonna do. So I'm gonna do the top row first. I'm gonna stick my fingers in there really good, run it down my arm right here, and show you what that looks like. So you can see it's kind of a holographic glow. The purple's really pretty. The pinks I probably will use on my face because they'll go with my skin tone a little bit more. Um, but those are super, super pigmented and they're very pretty. And I will say they look pretty holographic, if you ask me. I'm gonna wipe those off and show you the bottom row. And these are the colors I'm probably less likely to use, uh, with the exception of the yellow. So those are the colors. And I'm gonna do those. So you can see the blue and the green and the yellow. They're super, super pigmented. I think they might actually make interesting eyeshadows. So I'll probably use them more for that purpose because I'm not into this whole like um, galaxy type stuff. I like more of the, uh, okay, please stop. I, I should have a blooper for this, seriously. Yeah, yeah. So that being said, that was the last product. So in all, I, I'd say we definitely got our money's worth. It's over $100 in product. For $21, uh, again, this is the box that it came in. It comes with like a little protective thing so nothing gets messed up. But you can go look at their past boxes. I don't think there's been one box that I wouldn't have wanted to get. This is my first one, but there's some that I regret that I didn't sign up sooner. So for $21, um, the reason why I signed up for this is because I was paying $10 for an Ipsy bag and $10 for this bag and $10 for this bag. And they just came with little samples. Like they, It wasn't even enough to really tell if you wanted to like that product or not. Um, so this getting a full size product for $21 for several that you'd probably go to Ulta and spend over $100 on. Do it, girl. Give this box. All right. Okay, guys. Well, that's all I have for you. If you have any questions on this box, let me know. As I try new things, I will let you know. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.